Well, the Cappy Cappy machine is no more, and now it's being called the Cappy Gotcha. But this is something you're gonna wanna start preparing for because we have two pets that you can get at this, and they're both gonna be immortal. Now, if you didn't know, they nerfed a whole bunch of these questers, so they're a ton easier to get. And now we can actually get a lot more of these lucky silver coins, 35 in total. But at 300 pulls a piece, that might not be enough for you. So don't worry, you can save these things, they will carry over. However though, the next one will be an advanced artifact that will take 500 pulls to get the pity on it there. Luckily for me, this one was only 300 and I was able to get it in 140 pulls. I said this before, this is not the only way to get these lucky silver coins. Actually, the best way in my opinion to get them is by going over into the dungeon dive. And once you complete all your tickets in there, you can go and purchase two more with gems and that's something I suggest you do every single day. You'll only be seeing these coins though when you beat every 10 levels, I believe it is. So you might have to try it a couple of times, but it's definitely worth doing so. So there is two immortal pets that we can get from this, which are going to be Freya and Peggy. And given that I'm a skill kind of build on my game, I figured that Freya was gonna be the better one to go for it. And the fact that she's going to give an additional skill crit rate and additional skill damage. Although Piggy doesn't look too bad too. I actually started thinking about this here. The fact that it is going to give additional attack and lifesteal, I thought to myself, do I just go and drop the little Ellie there and then just run three immortals? And I said, you know what? I'm gonna hold off on the advanced artifact that's coming up and try to get two pulls out of those. When you do finally land on one of these, you will get 20 copies, which is enough to take it to level 16 inside the game. So you will get those passive buffs there of plus 6% for attack, defense, and HP. So that's gonna be a nice little gain too. Plus, now you got an immortal pet. So as far as when this will pop up for you, if you have the Mount Growth event going on right now, which typically lasts two days, the second that ends, there will be a day's break, and then you'll be seeing this Cappy machine pop up. So get out there and do those dungeon dives. You really want those silver coins. But the big question is, is what should I do with the coins I have here right now? Should I go and actually save them for the artifacts and try to pull two of those? Or should I keep on pumping these into Freya to really try to see how high of a level I can get her? Or the artifact, I don't have Piggy yet. So I could try to get that and just say, hey, I finally unlocked all the pets in the game. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And if you want to know what whaling really gets you inside this game, take a look at this video right here. Thanks for watching and remember, I pick my butt.